All right, so this is a look at the os cocci, which is also more commonly known as your hip bone. This is going to be made up of three different bones. We're going to have the first part that's up here, and this is going to be called the ilium. And then in front, going this way, is going to be my pubic bone or my pubis bone. And then going back this way is going to be my ischium, and we'll get to those in just a minute. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at the ilium. So if we look at this here, you can see there's this part here. If you were to feel down by your side, you could actually feel all of this. And this is called the iliac crest. And then if we look, if I flip this over, if we look, this is the posterior portion of the ilium. And over here is the anterior portion. So on the anterior portion, this is going to be my anterior superior iliac spine. That's going to be right here. And then I got my anterior inferior iliac spine, which is right here. And then I'm going to have my posterior superior iliac spine, which is right there. And then my posterior inferior iliac spine, which is this portion right here. The way I can tell the front from the back, if I haven't mentioned already, is by this rough area here. This is going to attach to the sacrum and it's going to form the sacroiliac joint. If we look right here, this is called the greater sciatic notch. So there's my greater sciatic notch right there. And that's going to be it for the ilium. If we look now, if we, let's do the pubis bone. There's really not a whole lot to this. We just have this portion of the acetabulum. Oh, really quick on the ilium. It makes the superior portion of the acetabulum. This whole thing here, it's called the acetabulum. And your femur attaches to that, the head of the femur. So this portion is going to be the ilium. If we look here, we can see a little line there and this here. All of this would be the pubic bone. And the pubic bone is going to articulate with another os cocci to form the pubic symphysis, just like that. And that's going to be right in the pubic area. If we look back here on the ischium, so the ischium is going to be all of this that you see back this way. And if we look at this, um, you can see it's this portion of the acetabulum. And then if we look in the back, we have the ischial spine, which is right there. And then right under the ischial spine, we have the lesser sciatic notch. So this was the greater sciatic notch, and this was the lesser sciatic notch. This rough portion that you can see kind of like right there, that whole rough portion there, if I turn it sideways, you might be able to see a little bit better. This is called the ischial tuberosity. And when you sit down, this is basically what you're sitting on. This portion here is called the ramus, and it's made up of my pubic bone and my ischium. This is the obturator foramen that's right in here. This big hole right here is the obturator foramen. Okay, and then that is it for the os cocci. Thanks for watching.